Tag. So, heute noch einmal lernen wir Deutsch hier online. Und was lernen wir heute? Heute gibt es auch eine neue Grammatik Unterricht. Was ist diese Grammatik? Das ist eine sehr wichtige Grammatik. Adjektive. Heute lernen wir Adjektive. Today uh, we are going to learn Adjectives. It's a grammar lesson. So, it's very important to know Adjectives. Uh, uh, when we are learning Adjectives, uh, it's a very vast um, lesson. So, uh, we are doing only one section of Adjectives. Uh, there is something uh, called in uh, German for Adjectives, Adjective Deklaration. That is Adjective Endungen. But today we are going to learn not direct Adjective Deklaration, but uh, Comparative und Superlative. Heute lernen wir Comparative und Superlative. So, was ist Comparative und Superlative? Oh, so, uh, wir benutzen Comparative und Superlative, wenn man etwas uh, vergleichen, when we are comparing something or some person with another person or something, then we use this comparative. Comparative of Deutsch, that is comparative. Here, comparative und superlative. So, für unsere Abitur, A-Level, Prüfung, müssen wir auch comparative und superlative gut lernen. We should learn, we, uh, we should know comparative and superlative for A level exam and also we ask why, ask why exam, ask why proofing, müssen wir auch comparative and superlative gut lernen. So, what is comparative and superlative? That is like by speed. Here is like by speed. This is an example for comparative and superlative. Good, good. What is good? Good. Uh, Tina is good fear method. Tina is good fear method. Tina is good for maths. Und Diana is better fear method. Diana is better than Tina. There are now two people we are comparing. Compare Tina und Diana. Tina is good fear method, aber Diana is besser fear method. Moni is a besten fear method. Moni is a besten fear method. So, es gibt hier drei Menschen, drei Personen, Tina, Diana und Moni. So, Es ist mal vergleichen wir Tina, Tia, Tina und Diana. Tiana ist gut für Mathe, aber Diana ist besser als Diana ist besser als Tina. Diana ist better than Tina. So we use als there. When you use comparative, comparative then we use als then to say that in English. Diana is besser als Tina. Und am besten, wer ist am besten? Who is the best from all these three? Am besten is money. Am besten is money. So, das ist superlative. Superlative means uh, from all of them, the best is superlative. We call it superlative. Comparative only from two people, two persons. One is better than this one. That is what is comparative or superlative. When we have calculation, we do not send here. That's good. So, what's now? What's okay? Here is our kind of client by speed. This is also an, a small example and this is an advertisement about this regal, this is signed regal. 
Höher, breiter, tiefer. Höher means higher, breiter means wider, tiefer means deeper. Those are the meaning of these words. So that is how I am sure the finish. Good. That is no fear. Comparative. Kind. Superlative gift is here. Good. That is how kind shares build. What is done in this build? What can one here say? What can one see here? That is a land card. Here is a land card. This is a map. World map. And here is a blue map. What is in here? Blue map. Feel like blue was in the Dry blue was in the on bus, it is here. Here is the inclined house. Here is the outclined house and those house. And das is ein Schloss. Was is das? Das ist ein Schloss. A palace. A castle. We call it Schloss. And here is the rose house. Big house. Here is the normal house. Normal house. Okay. We vergleichen these build. How do we compare these things, these, these pictures? Good. Europa. What is to Europa? What is to go Europa? Is Deutschland is in Europa. Here is, this is Europa. Here is Asia. Here is African. Here is Australian. Here is America, North America, South America, good. So, Europa is gross. Europa is gross. Europa is big. And Africa, what things do? What things do? Africa is grosser or Europa is grosser? Yeah, good. Africa is grosser. Africa is closer as Europa. Africa is closer as Europa. Our was is from Roston. Which land is from Roston? Which country? Which continent is the biggest from these three? Asian is from Roston. Asian is from Roston. Europa is gross. Africa is grosser as Europa and Asian East and Roston. So what have we done game out? What have we changed here to make comparative and superlative? Now this is the normal adjective gross. We have add ER to this normal adjective. We have add ER to the normal adjective. And here, when there is O, we have a rule out to that. I will tell you later when should be at uh, umlaut. Uh, good. So, that is how we make comparative. Now, we take the normal adjective and then we add ER to that adjective. That is how we make the Comparative. And then how to make the superlative? Superlative, normally we use am here, preposition and undan. T E N, roasted. T E N. Now, find by spill here, shirt. Shirt. What is shirt? Beautiful. Shirt means beautiful. So here it becomes shirt. Und am schönsten. Schön, schöne, am schönsten. Gross, grosser, am grossten. Gut, wir können auch bilden, um, wir können auch Sätze bilden hier mit dieser Wette auch. Gut, wie uh, Europa ist groß, können wir auch, auch sagen, das Haus hier ist groß, aber das uh, House here is grosser. Das Schloss ist 
am größten. Das Schloss ist am größten. Und hier diese weiße Blume ist schön. Und gelbe Blume ist schöne. Aber am schönsten ist diese Blume. Okay, so, das ist, wie man diese äh, Komparative und Superlative benutzen und bilden. Gut. Hier ist ein noch ein Beispielsetzer, aber hier ist äh, also ein Example, a Sentence. Äh, das ist das schnellste Auto. Here it's a little bit different because after the, this uh, superlative suffix, this superlative adjective, normally we don't use the noun again here, but here the noun we have used. So how to use that? Das is das, because this is auto is das, we have used das here, definite article, das auto. Now in between the Definite article and the noun we have used the superlative uh, adjective. So when we are using the superlative adjective, uh, in between these two words, we make, we take schnell, schnell is fast and then we add st, schnellst, for that, for st we add e. Because here it is das definite article. Normally we add e before auto. So das is das schnellste auto. This is the fastest car. This is the fastest car. This is the normal word, normal adjective here in this sentence. And this is the superlative suffix here. And here this e we use. Because when we are using auto with definite article, any noun with the definite article, we add e to the end of the adjective. That's why here we, should, we have used e. So that is how we make this schnellste auto. Can you understand this first sentence? Yeah. I'll clear this now final. I'll explain it to you again because it might be a little complex for you all. Das ist das schnellste Auto. Now I told that there is this um, adjective declinationa or adjective ending. Um, that is the end, how, do, how do we use the ending of the adjective uh, for daddy does. Because this is definite article after the uh, after the adjective normally we use e. For das or der or d, any word, we use just e. We don't use uh, es or er when we use the definite article here. So now we have used das is das. That means the uh, definite article of auto. And now we are using the adjective here with the superlative. So adjective is schnell, fast, and then Superlative is st and the e we add as the uh, letter that we use normally after the adjective. So that is how we make, have made this sentence. Das is the schnellste, schnellste auto. This is the fastest car. Okay, good. We are machen viele, viele Übungen mit diesen uh, Adjektiven. Dann sicher. Um, alle verstehen das uh, gut. We are doing a lot of exercises with these sentence patterns and then definitely you all will understand this clearly. Okay, so here sind ein paar oder etwa Werte, Adjektive uh, mit normal Adjektiv und dann Comparative und dann Superlative. Ich erkläre nicht alle jetzt sondern wir können Beispiele sehen. Gut. Uh, 
Now, I'm not going to explain the meaning of this all the words now, but you all can go through this uh, Suhausa uh, and then find the meanings and learn the words well. Active, active is active, 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 um, active still. In the class, where is so active? In unser Deutsch class, where is it? Uh, so active. In our class, who is very active? And then we can say, okay, uh, Hans is so active. Our Peter is active. Our, our active still is uh, young. Like that, uh, we compare. Uh, the ones who are very active in the class and like that is it feel better here alt, elder, am um, eldest old, older, the oldest am, 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 am here you can see the umlaut is there for a am is poor, poorer, the most poorest English, English, I am English, English, I am English, stand. Bekannt, bekannte, I am bekannt, stand. Berühmt, berühmte, I am berühmt, stand. Billig, billige, I am billig, stand. Böse, böse, I am böse, stand. Bright, brighte, I am bright, stand. Bunt, Bunte, am Bunterstein. Dunkel, Dunkel, am Dunkelsten. Durstig, Durstige, am Durstigesten. Dünn, Dünne, am Dünnsten. Eilig, Eilige, am Eiligsten. Einfach, Einfacher, Einfachsten. Eng, Enge, am Engsten. Falsch, faul, faule, am faulsten. Fest, feste, am feste. Fleisig, fleisige, am fleisigsten. Geduldig, geduldige, am geduldigsten. Geisig, geisige, am geisigsten. Und so weiter. Okay, so. These are Wörter, es gibt viele noch Wörter, there are a lot of more words for you all to learn. So, uh, see, you said, die alle diese uh, Adjektive ein List machen, you have to make a list of these words und dann diese Wörter finden, was bedeutet diese Wörter, you have to find the meaning of these words and then you have to study the words. Good. Now, here I have explained uh, what you should do to make the comparative. For the adjective, as I told you earlier, this, uh, you have to use er. You have to add er. Here, uh, here it is clearly shown how to make the comparative. Adjective plus er. Adjective plus er. Und für superlative am. Um, dann Adjective hier plus S, T, A, N. You have to use am here, then the adjective and then S, T, E, N. That is how you make superlative. Comparative kurzen Werte. A, O, U. Was machen wir? Comparative kurzen Werte. A, O, U. With these words A, O, U, we have to add Umlaut. A, ö, ü. So, how are, well, there are a lot of bias we Gross, gröse, am größten. Hoch, höhe, am höchsten. Like that. Okay, there are, because of the, uh, these vowels, we have add umlaut for those words. Alt, 
Älter am ältesten. Bleibt er. And for superlative, let's do star for the last uh, letter. We add S T E N. Großten. Pessimisten. Schönsten. Like that, we have read S T E N. That is how we make superlative. But there are some exceptional exceptions. Some words we uh, change, some completely the word changes. Is keep trying to be on the form and some wise will feel. Feel becomes where. And then a meister. Feel where a meister. Here. Here are the dry form. All the three forms. Hoch, Hörge. Am höchsten, hier gibt es Umlaut. Gut, besser, am besten. Hier, this is exceptional word. Gut becomes besser, and then besser becomes am besten. Hier, viel becomes mehr, and then am meisten. Different word, viel, has changed to mehr. That means it's completely different, another word. So you have to remember that. Special these words you have to remember, especially not like other normal adjectives, it's changing. Good becomes lesser and a mister. Feel becomes mehr, a meister. Okay. So was yeah. Here is the kind of you no? What is this a you? For clash in the class. What is this? We have a Verschiedene Schulen und Schülerinnen in unserer Klasse. We have different, different uh, students in our class. So, uh, we are going to compare these uh, children, these students mm. and their abilities. We can, or abilities or their appearance, we can compare. So, how are we going to compare? You can compare your friends. What are the questions that we are going to ask when we are comparing? So, if we are doing uh, this lesson in the class, it's very interesting. We can make sentences, we can build a sentence on Fragen mit einander, Fragen stellen, sehr interessant. We can do a spiel, we can do a game with this. So now unfortunately, uh, we are doing uh, online, we are online, so we can't do that interaction. Uh, which uh, we are doing uh, during the classes, but still, we'll see how we can do this even from home. You can ask your friends these questions and write sentences. Where is Bizarre in sport? Or a mother, or English, music, Deutsch, English literature, informatic, and so on. Okay, so who is better in sports? That's English or Dutch. So you can tell your friends or the colleagues' names, classmates' names. Where is the best? Who is the best? Where is the best in film? Dutch. Where is the best in film? Informatic. Where is the best in film? Sports. And so on. Where is elder, younger, or better than younger? See, Kenan. Gebistag finden, Gebistag fragen und dann, wer ist ältere finden, wer ist jüngsten, am jüngsten finden. You can ask from your friends in the class their birthdays and then uh, you can arrange in order and then you can find who is the youngest in the class and who is the eldest in, in the class. Wir können auf Deutsch um, diskutieren und sprechen über diese Sachen. We can uh, discuss uh, with our friends in German about these things. Where is Klein or the Größer? Am Kleinsten or am Größten? Who is smaller uh, and bigger physically? And who is the most smallest and biggest? These things we can find in the class. 
Well, I feel may I might say that. Isn't it interesting this fragger? Who laughs more? Who laughs the most? Yeah, we can thus out think that. Not feel may adjective, musicalish, sportlish, lustish, and so on. Who is um, who likes music a lot? Who is sporty? Who is very funny or happy? Feel adjective and in the. We can with the these adjective and benutzen. That is say in the sun when one this adjective benutzen on über dein Freund or Freundin erzählen. Good. Es gibt ein noch eine interessante Frage. Wer ist schön? Wer ist schön? Ich habe hier Bilder von sehr berühmten Schauspielerinnen. Zwei Schauspielerinnen. Ich habe berühmte Schauspielerinnen hier. I have pictures of very famous two actresses. Nicht aus Sri Lanka, sondern aus Indien. Not from Sri Lanka, but from India. Bollywood Schauspielerinnen. Where is Shannon? We are going to find who is most more prettier than the other one. So I have the pictures, and you can decide. You can think who is the most prettiest. Okay. We heist C. We heist C. C heist. Alia Bhatt. C heist Alia Bhatt. And where is C? Deepika Padukone. Alia Bhatt and Deepika Padukone. So where is Shannon? What's next to? Alia Bhatt. Or the Deepika Padukone. That's the same frog from Mish. Next is small. Comes to thus near Sagar. Unimportant. There is Shannon. Alia Bhatt. Or the Deepika Padukone. Ish Glaube. Smile Mount Mainu. Vielleicht die Pika Patagon ist schöner als Alia Bart. Okay, gut. Bitte, mach mal eine Umfrage mit deinen Freunden in der Klasse. Jetzt noch ein Spiegel. Again, we are going to do a game. Das ist auch von unserem Unterricht. Bitte machen eine Umfrage. Was ist eine Umfrage? Was ist eine Umfrage? Question. Question hier. So, we are going to ask our friends diese Frage. Where is the Freundlichst? Hier benutzen wir Superlative. Hier benutzen wir Superlative. Where is the Freundlichst? Who is the most friendliest one? Where is the Klugst? Who is the most brightest or the brainy one? Where is the Schoenstein? Who is the most prettiest one? So like that, unser writer means, etc. You can make more questions. You can build a frog. Als sein Hausaufgaben, you must say frog in dein Heft schreiben. Du musst sehen Frage in dein Heft schreiben. You have to write in questions. You can make any questions you like. And you, have, you can ask or we will do it when the school starts. We can ask from each other these questions and make uh, the answers. Form the answers. So if you like, you can make the questions, 10 questions. Will sehen Frage und dann du kannst auch on who to schreibe. You can think and write the answers also. Okay, das ist superlative und comparative 
ich erkläre schnell nach einmal. I will explain this is the comparative municipality. I will quickly go through it again. Okay, comparative municipality, good, besser, am besten. So good becomes besser and am besten is superlative. Und hier höher, breiter und tiefer. Höher, breiter und tiefer. Hier ist ein Beispiel. Das ist ein Landkart. Europa ist groß. Afrika ist größer. Asien ist am größten. Und hier gibt es Häuser. So ein Häuser und auch ein Schloss. Und hier gibt es ein, äh, ein hier gibt es drei Blumen, Blumen. Also, mit diesen Bildern können wir auch Comparative und Superlative Sätze bilden. Hier ist ein Satz mit Superlative Suffix. Das ist das schnellste Auto. Das ist das schnellste Auto. Hier ist ein Adjektiv Liste. Uh, mit Komparativ und Superlativ. Es gibt noch mehr viele Adjektiven. Sie müssen diese Adjektive in dein Heft schreiben und uh, Komparativ und Superlativ bilden. Sie können diese uh, ein List von Adjektiven schreiben und dann Komparativ und Superlativ bilden. You can make a list of Adjektives, you can find a list of Adjektives and then You have to make the comparative and superlative on your own and then find the meaning. Okay, how are we making comparative? We take the adjective and we add er. And how to make superlative? We for, we, for the adjective we use am here and then sde. That is how we make the superlative. And if there is a, o, o, u, these vowels, then we have to add Umlaut for the letters. Superlative, always the last letter we add SDE. And there are some, es gibt eine besondere Form. There are special exceptional words like feel, mehr am meisten. Gut, besser am besten. Okay, hier gibt es noch ein paar, noch ein paar Beispiele. Hoch, höher, am höchsten. Gut, besser, am besten. Viel, mehr, am meisten. Vergleich in der Klasse. Hier vergleichen wir in der Klasse. Wir haben unsere Freunde, viele Schüler und Schülerinnen. Wir können diese Fragen stellen und dann vergleichen mit Comparative und Superlative beide. Wer ist besser in Sport, Mathe, Englisch, Musik, Deutsch? Wer ist am besten? Diese Frage können wir von äh, unseren Freunden fragen und dann mehr üben. Okay, wer ist schön? Hier sind zwei berühmte Schauspielerinnen. Alia Bhatt und Dita Padua. Wer ist am schönsten? Vielleicht Alia Bhatt ist am schön, äh, schöner als Alia Bhatt ist schöner als Deepika Padukon. Oder Deepika Padukon ist schöner als Alia Bhatt. Und hier noch einmal, es gibt äh, eine Umfrage mit Superlativ. Wer ist am freundlichsten? Wer ist am glücksten? Wer ist am schönsten? Gut, so das können wir auch machen. Na, Sie müssen sehr Sätze schreiben in deinem Heft und auch Antwort schreiben. Das ist deine Hausaufgabe. Bis nächstes Mal. So, das ist unser Unterricht heute. Nicht sehr lang, sondern sehr interessant, glaube ich. So, das ist alles für heute. Uh, that's all we are going to learn for today, the uh, adjectives, comparative and superlative. 
so children i hope you all have understood this um, lesson well so uh, we will till we meet again uh, study well and be safe feel and done on our feet say